Seven, seven o'clock on the dot, but not anymore because you made me wait. <laughs> it Every... was seven, seven o'clock and like 14 seconds. Well, hello, everybody. And welcome back to Kimball's Corner. I hope you all had a lovely weekend slash past week. Uh, let's all just... No! I was just about to talk about forgetting the trauma of last week's <laughs> video. <laughs> if you saw last week's video, you understand. You get me. It was traumatizing. All right. Bonnie says, hi, Kimball and Rocky. It's, it's me. Yes. I just wanted to pop in and say thank you for doing this. It means a lot. This week has been incredibly stressful, and I hope you guys are doing okay. And again, thank you. Kimball, explain. Yes. So I chatted with Bonnie. I'm calling her Bonnie. I don't know if that's her true name. It's... I don't know, I don't, right? It's like half Bonnie. Yes, let us know, Bonnie. So I'm gonna call you Bonnie because I like it. Um, so her little ferret had some babies and then the mama ferret got sick and she put up a good fight and she did not make it. Um, so I thought, let's draw a ferret human cross character thing. It was Bonnie's idea actually, but I thought that was a good idea and it'd be fun. And it's not scenery, so. That is the I most important thing. I think I can kind of pull it off. I had to look at pictures of ferrets because I've only seen one in real life. And that was like 15 years ago at my brother's house. And so I'm going to use this little cootie patootie as a reference. I don't know what Bonnie's actual ferret. I believe it's pronounced Eros, Eros. I don't know. E-U-R-U-S. Either way. Um, I, don't, I don't know the markings on her personal ferret. But I went with this one. So. We're going to do like the whole ink splat thing and uh, hopefully that'll kind of make up for some of the markings and uh, then I'll just kind of make it up with some watercolor. I'm going to use... What's the snack? What are you doing? <sighs> the Santa snack challenge. Yeah. How many of these have we done, Kimball? Today's snack is the Kubijoto. Hold it up into frame though. Just a little bit. Oh, there you go. Perfect. It's so big. Anyway, it's a huge bag of chocolates, which I opened on the side so you wouldn't know, and I've been sneaking them out all week long. They're delicious. They're not overly sweet. They're very, like, good chocolatey flavor. I would rate them as up there with my, like, top, I don't know, something-somethings with my... Something-something? Yeah, did you tone that down? Tone down the... We're not too bright on this channel. Wait, that sounds like we're dumb. <laughs> don't overexpose. I'm exposed. Anyway, so I got some Tim Holtz Distress Sprays and then my Jane Davenport. This one is so old. Like I opened it probably four or five years ago. I know there's bacteria growing inside there. We don't care. Shh. It's because I used like a dirty brush when I was using it and air and dust got into it and we don't care. But I think it's clean now. I think I cleaned it up. Anyway, we're going to use it up until it's all gone. So I'm going to do a background with these colors. I'm going to spray it with water, close the book on it, and then try and draw a woman, which it's great because ferrets have long necks. We all like to draw. Well, I like to draw, you know, extremely long necks on my female characters when I'm just doing a portrait. And we'll give her maybe some dark eye makeup or a masky looking thing. Uh, cute little pink lips. I don't know because I saw some with pink noses and brown noses. We'll see which one. I that, They're both cute. I don't know. I always do pink noses though. Everyone is saying hi. And then Trisha's pointing out that it's only 11 p.m. in the UK. Yay. Yay. Who else was excited to wake up so early this morning because they couldn't sleep? Okay, so two other things we're going to do after this drawing is done. One is, is a journal flip. And we have how many left? Two. Okay, so one or number two. one through two. All, all the <laughs> choices. Whoever has the first number is what we're going to flip through. And also, we had we bought a piece of art from a gentleman in Montmartre um, and had it framed. Don't know his name. And we are going to show you what that looks like at the end because it was a fun process. It was the first time we ever had something like professionally, air quotes, professionally framed. Um, so we're going to show what that looks like. It looks Funny. fabulous and we are very happy with it. I mean, you can tell how gay we are by how long we spent picking out those frames. <laughs> it was a really close run. Trisha and Denise were neck and neck, but Trisha got number one. Number one it is. Oi! That's fine. We're all fine. No addresses or anything. Uh, I don't think Social so. Social security numbers, credit this, card numbers. Nope. This is the uh, it had the very first page is the very first live I did okay. with with people like you know expecting them to be. They're not like surprise, Kimball. We're watching you. Oh yes. Got all it. right. Okay. So let's get let's down to business. business every time, Kimball. And spray. Time out. Which one of these, Kim? 
Which one of these should I be oh trying God, to please. eat? Like it's a struggle. They're chocolates. Should I do the purple one? No. Or this one? No. Or this one? Yes. But it's a smaller one. No, it's not. Irma, it's fine. Okay, great. Thanks, bye. Are you Off having, you go. If you're having one, I'm having one now. I'm just going to spray the page. You'll see what's happening. I'm going to eat this delicious chocolate. This one is the almond one. Oh, there's two wraps. That's how you know it's good when there's two wraps. That mm -hmm. means they're really protecting the flavor or they're hiding something. You never know, really. I always love it when I get a, just a bit of chocolate in my artwork. Water. Done. Mmm. That's very good. Mm-hmm. Megan's Makeup Love says, hi guys, how are you? Hearts. Well, you know, we're good. Thank you. How are you doing? Doing great, Campbell, thanks. Oh, that's lovely to hear. Uh-oh. Whoopsies. Oh, that's a Tim Holtz one that ain't happening. Um, let's try this. Next, you know, I'll just use Jane's. It's in a different spray bottle, but I want some yellow in it. Just a little bit. I should have used the other yellow. What am I thinking? That was ink. Anyway. Some of that. It's all happening for a reason, and we just accept it and move on. Yes. I need to get the goobers out of here. What is that flavor in that chocolate? The one you had was mm -hmm. coffee. Was it? But it's like super mild. There's another flavor there. It's it, The chocolate I just had was a coffee flavor, but Oi. there's something in the background. It's like hazelnut or something. I don't know what it is. It's well, good I would not be surprised. All right, we're going to zhuzh it around just a little bit. That I, mica looks kind of gross. I haven't been having caffeine. And then today we went out and had a little lunch at At Waters, um, which is right by the Trader Joe's near our house. Um, and I got a regular coffee, which was like a large cup and a half of regular coffee. And now I have the most nervous energy that I just don't know. I'm like sitting here, like looking both directions. Like, what? where does it go? Where do I put the energy? Where? Do, how do I get rid of it? You can do some artwork. No, I don't think that's going to help. Okay. Well. Sure. Trying to keep my hands steady? I don't think so. <laughs> Am I keeping my hands steady? Kimball, no. Well, you've got a very interesting shape in the center happening there. Are you talking about my belly? There's a hair right there. I got hair down there. I need one of these. Oi! I'm going to just dab up some of that. Dab up some of that. The mica kind of looks dirty, but I feel like it's going to dry sparkly. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm not familiar with it. Ah, it smells good. Plumeria. So what did you guys get up to this week? Anything fun? I know Trisha said this week was a blast. Can you tell us more? Yeah, like a blast of cold air yesterday when we had snow. <laughs> like, where did that come from? It went from like 60 degrees to like 28. Feels like 11. I was like, oh, thank you. And then tomorrow's going to be up in, in the, the 60s, 60s. And then it'll be up in the 70s. Nice and toasty. I'm sure it's like that everywhere. It's like, I think everyone likes to think their weather's sporadic, but I kind of feel like it's that everywhere. Maybe not. No, we're special. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I think everyone's, it was like that in Portland too. Yeah. And Idaho. I feel like I see people posting, they're like, weather in Idaho be like, weather in Carolina be like, and it's like all the same. Right. I kind of feel like I should add some hot cocoa because this is pretty pale. Hot, Hot cocoa, cocoa is an ink color. I do kind of like that sparkly mica thing happening. But I do need or want some more contrast. So, bringing in the hot cocoa. Oh, Trisha was talking about your live last week. About oh. it being a blast. Oh, girl. Now, Kimball did pick that piece back up and made some changes to it. But he said he wasn't going to show it to everyone tonight. So, unless you all really hound him to do it in the comments, there's nothing I can do. There ain't nothing y'all can do because you ain't here. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need to relive traumatic experiences. If you weren't here, Kimball was looking. He, he had like this old Indiana Jones journal that the paper's made of like, I don't know, two ply pulp. It's like basically toilet paper. <laughs> two ply pulp. And he was like trying to, <laughs> he was trying to paint a landscape from our trip to uh, Germany. And he doesn't think it worked out. I think it looks great. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? It was like color blobs fail. I mean, it looks pretty. Like, the colors were pretty, I thought. But as scenery, no. I know. Nancy did a centaur repaint on an Avitrotter doll. 
Avia, Ooh, Avia, that's cool. Avia Trotter? What is Avia Trotter? Um, something you don't know about, obviously. Clearly. I'm thinking you don't either since you didn't answer. I don't, but I feel like you're saying it wrong. So um, that's not my fault. I don't know. Bonnie's been ill. That's sad. I'm sorry, Bonnie. Oh, Bonnie. Feel better. Everything You need to feel better. You've been through enough. You had better feel better, Bonnie. I don't want the dark dots. So I'm grabbing. Elaine says she just watched the replay. It was great. Thumbs up. <laughs> Well, you know, see see how people give you that false you know, sense of assurance, Kimball. If you like that, like and subscribe for more quality content. Nancy says it's a Monster High doll. Yes. Gotcha. Every time I see here Monster High, I just think of like not what it intends, but like like someone has a Monster High. Mm. Like yeah, that's all high. I think about someone. I do like the added dark colors. Um, Let's see what else is happening. This smells so good. Now it smells like, oh my God, it smells like cocoa and plumeria. Like I'm having a hot cocoa in like a field of flowers. This is lovely. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's like a peachy smell here and then a cocoa-y, chocolatey smell here. Oh, and if you guys do enjoy the lives, please give it, smash that thumbs up button. <laughs> give, give Kimmel's channel a little like and subscribe. It really helps. I'm not sure how or why, but people say it. Does. But we hear them say it, so we have to say it too. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be just like them. <laughs> Uh, we sure do have fun. I like this side better than this side because this has the texture and this isn't the textured side, but we'll work with it. I was debating if I wanted to go through like with an elegant look or if I wanted to do like a super cartoony. I think I'm going to go more elegant. Mm. But I need to make sure the paper is super dry. Otherwise, it gets a little ripped up from the colored pencils. So forgive me for taking a little extra time drying the pages. This is where, you know, when people watch the replay, they're like, and skip. No, no. Don't skip ahead. This is the climb, as Miley Cyrus would say. It's the climb. It's all about the journey. All right, I think it's good enough. There was gonna be another mountain. Ugh, that just sounds like a lot more work ahead of you. Like, Well, I mean, that's life, isn't it? I don't know. I got just a couple hills and valleys. I don't really have mountains to get over. Bonnie wants to know if she could have a snack, please. Yes, here, one second, Bonnie. Bonnie, do you want okay? Here comes. Do you want snack. purple, blue, or brown? It's caramel, almond, or coffee. Is this almond? Yes. Okay, you don't get a brown one. Um, I guess it's just coffee or, or caramel. More in here. I want to ask though if anybody knows what. I think it's Gian G Gian Duia. Oh, I see a spike heel in the lower corner right here. No, you don't. Yeah, right here. I see it. What do you talk? Yep. Purple, here it comes. What is the purple one? Is that caramel? It seems like it'd be caramel. It's not yes, it's caramel. It's lavender. All right, here you go, Bon. I just want to call you Bon Bon, like a delicious little snack. Let us know how that is. You didn't even take the wrapper off for her. That is rude. That is her job. I'm not going to put my fingers on her chocolate. <laughs> just sounds wrong. It does it? Okay, well, anyway. I mean, you know. Anyway, Bonnie, let us know how that chocolate was. Let us know if you can figure out what that flavor in the background is, because I couldn't figure it out. So something makes you go, hmm. Although maybe the caramel one's different. I don't know. Yeah, but why you got to have a hundred little tiny strong magnets? What is this? Why? Because someday I'm going to put together a watercolor palette of my dreams. What if that someday is now? No. That could be next week's live. I've got other things going on. Oh, in my okay, life. great. Hmm. Browns. A couple of French grays. White. Bonnie says, thank you. Gaming at the same time is so hard. What are you gaming? What game are you playing? It better not be like Quirtle. <laughs> I'm Just doing kidding. pretty good with my Quirtles. Quirtle's fun too. Stressful, but fun. Um. <laughs> Kimball said his stomach's been in turmoil. I guess he's trying to prove it to everyone. Hey, we're not. <laughs> and by the smell of it, I'd say he's doing a good job. <laughs> um, he, she is playing Warzone. Well, that sounds peaceful. <laughs> <laughs> all right it sounds like the everyday life we live in i know but we're not gonna go there this is an escape channel it's escape from reality welcome to kimball's corner mm -hmm. everything's on. fun and nothing's bad <laughs> where we're gonna work with browns today <laughs> mm, brown colored chocolate adrian says hi jenna thank you for acknowledging my presence i really appreciate it well hey <laughs> Hi, Adrian. Let's sing a song for Adrian. She didn't feel like she was loved and appreciated yet. 
Abigail, Adrian, she is here to watch the live. Welcome, Welcome to Kimbo's Corner, YouTube, it's fun. <laughs> all right, that's all you got. All right, that was, yeah, that was bad. No, it wasn't. Adrian loves it. No. Oh, well. Bet you anything. All right, so we're taking this this little dude, or dudette. Can he just stay in the frame the whole time? I really don't want him to leave again. I have so much work to do that keeping a ferret in frame is hard. Is, is that today's challenge? Everything has to be sung? Like, what's happening? Yes. Okay, great. All right. Wait, which side is that? I kind of want a ferret now. But I saw this YouTube no. video that was like, ferrets outlawed in the U.S? Question mark. And I was like, also, I'm not like my brother this. had one. It was like, I'm going to eat all your straws and hide things in the couch. And then he hid in the couch. And that was the end of him. Oh. No, I'm just kidding. He survived. <laughs> but it was scary. I was like, oh, there's a thing crawling between the cushions. <sighs> ferrets. Adorable. D says, so looking at this before you started, it looks like a uterus. I tried to imply this earlier, but I Listen, didn't go there. But okay. D did. Well, it's D, D do. D do that. Don't. All right. We are going to de-uterus this and make it a verity face. <laughs> Adrian says, I'm not desperate, Rocky. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you, Adrian? All right, we want an eye here. They're we can't be... sense tone in the comments, y'all. What? Sorry, go ahead. Sense this tone, biatch. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> um, I'm going to kind of make the eyes a little weird because they're on the side of its head. So I'm going to try and do a human eye thing, but like place in there. Rocky has something Everyone to say. Everyone witness as Kimball tries to justify the future failure. Uh, <laughs> I make your breakfast. And I know where the poison is. Wow. What? Okay. Back on track, Adrian Rocky. says it looks like a butterfly. Let's go with that. Look, now I'm just distracted. In the shape of uterus. Okay, go on. <laughs> okay, go on. Listen, okay. Big eyeball. I see all sorts of genitalia. It's great. Anyway, so this is your first time ever drawing a ferret. Is that right? Well, a ferret human and a ferret, yes. Okay, speaking of like so animal the humans. Just black. Speaking of animal humans, what <laughs> movie did you watch yesterday? What movie did we watch yesterday, Rocky? Do you remember the name? Turning Red. Yes, and go ahead. I loved it. It was adorable. At first, Same. I was like, is this girl going to be super obnoxious? Because the intro was like a little over the top, but I like also loved it. Yeah, I really loved it. There was a scene, without Which giving anything one? away, towards the end. I mean, I loved all of it, but there was a scene when she's like, all I wanted to do was go to a concert. <laughs> and I laughed so, so loud. You laughed so much at that. Oh my gosh. I laughed so loud for so long at that. I kind of want her head on an angle, but I don't want to draw the like lines. Monica says they can't unsee the butterfly. Well, I mean, not really, but she can see it. We know what they're talking about. <laughs> the next to that flower, picture vagina. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that from Will and Grace? Yes. This is my hand. Sure, Jan. When my hand gets sweaty enough, I can, like, make this sound that Kimball doesn't appreciate. And why are your hands sweaty? I don't know, because I'm drinking warm or hot coffee, so I think they just get sweaty. I get the coffee sweats. <laughs> Aren't I lucky? I can tell this seat needs to be adjusted because this is what it sounds like when I just move. I know, it's very wiggly jiggly, but I can't find the tool, or I didn't. That one oh, time. so you knew it was the problem. Well, I don't sit there. Remember when Kimball threw away the three rechargeable batteries I got for the scale? Well, and then Rocky was like trying to prove that they were rechargeable. And I was like, no, they're not. It didn't say it. He's like, there's a green strip on it. And I was like, so? And then like he gave up and then I looked at it harder. And I was like, wait, it says it really tiny right there that's rechargeable. So I had to dig through the trash of cracked yucky eggs, salmon <laughs> guts, <laughs> and uh, bananas. Bananas, which I hate the smell of. But I found them, washed them, and we're good. See, it was like your own little punishment for not recycling. I need pink. Because those batteries should never have ended up in the trash anyway. I didn't mean to. They slipped and fell down the stairs and into the kitchen. What was I supposed to do? Your lies slipped. I, oh, there it is. It's like hiding. Because she has like pink little lips. Obviously, I'm doing a brown nose because that's what I did. I'm going to use just pinks for the lips. This is going to be the middle line. Adrian says she watched the Andy Warhol Diaries on Netflix. Quite an interesting human being. Have you seen it yet? Um, I have not. Not a huge fan of him, but, you know, I guess I could check it out. Um, let me make sure I didn't miss any other comments. Everything's looking fine. Something um, like okay, so let me that. cross off the turning. Uh, we really talked about everything that we were going <sighs> to talk about. We only wrote down two things. Well, we didn't really do it anything this week what else should we talk about you guys 
let us know in the comments. I'll be keeping monitor. I'll be keeping my eyes on it. She's got a small chin. No, we don't want to go outside. I don't like drawing outside of the splats. How many passwords? By the way, I'm just curious how many passwords people have because just for work alone, I'm going to count this up. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. I have 34 passwords that I have to regularly update and change and how just often, for work. How often do you use those passwords? Pretty consistently. Because like, what the hell do you use them for? They're just all different programs. And my personal oh, ones, pro, gotcha. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm going to give her huge eyes, but they're still going to be like pretty dark. But I do want her to have some whites because we got to have some of that human aspect in there. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 45 for a personal. I'm really so we're talking about like seven plus, 70 plus passwords for one person. And I'm like really excited for you for sharing this. What like, is happening? You know, I don't know. When did my life become passwords? I think you know. All right, and then I'm going to add just some hair. I feel like her hair... Okay, she needs to have cute ears. I'm going to put her ears where human ears are, but she's going to have cute little ferrety ears. Oh, that's weird. Um, Jenna says spring break starts this week, and Noah has decided he's going to drive eight hours round trip for barbecue. I mean, that's because no one knows where his priorities are. I'm glad I don't really like barbecue because I wouldn't do something crazy like that. Adrian says, where do you work, Rocky? The Pentagon? <laughs> <laughs> no, I actually work for McCormick. McCormick Spice Company. McCormick. Who um, also have stuff in everywhere, actually. They're a global company. But they have stuff in Italy and France and the UK. All Asian countries. I'm all basically anywhere where there's spice. Um, because the spice is nice. Bonnie's gonna be right back. All right, Bonnie. She got war zone going on. I can't wait though. You do, you girl. Do -ba -do -ba -do -do -do. All right, now I'm gonna bring in some watercolor. Wait, no, I need to add a little bit of hair ish. I'm just gonna darken these up a little. And if you didn't know, McCormick actually isn't just a spice company, like a flavor company. So they own all sorts of things. They have Frank's Red Hot, you might know of. They have French's Mustard. They have Stubbs Barbecue Sauce, Lowry's, Zatarans. The list goes on and on. You'd be very surprised. Anywhere you go in the store has McCormick stuff in it. So on our next live, we'll be using all these delicious spices. Kimball will use spices to make a paint palette. No, I meant like we'll go cook something. Kimball did have to paint with uh, ketchup once. That I was didn't fun. have to. Rocky was like, do this. It'll be fun. Mm, it was a blast. It actually turned out pretty cool, though. Yeah, no, it was like super great. It was great. Ten yeah. layers later, you can almost see it. Do you still have that? I wonder yes, what it I smells do. like. It did doesn't smell like anything. Oh, that's good. Thank God. Maybe it's all the sugar and vinegar. <sighs> I know. I was worried spiders. Ants were going to get up. Uh, sorry, just spritz in my palette. Spritz, spritz your palette. Not a euphemism. I hope. Okay, yeah, well. Oh, you calm down, circle thing. All right, so I've been debating. Do I want to give her like a fur texture? Do I want to make it look like freckles? Do I want to just paint her face? Her ears are so uneven. We don't mind. No one cares. <laughs> just kidding. Oh. They all care, Kimball. I don't think anyone does. I think they do. I don't think they do. Um, we are going to just lay down some, not flats, um, some just washy wash shadow shape stuff. Get some of this nice brown. Add a little bit of that in there. Some kiss kiss and cocoa. And light's coming from here. So we'll do shadows here. D says freckles. Freckles it is. Freckles. Did you ask that question? I did not even hear it. It was like, do I do freckles or do I do... I was clearly zoning out while you said that. Yeah, well. Sorry. Just like our marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Jenna says, I recently ran across Old Bay Hot Sauce. Um, so we bought that to try since Noah puts Old Bay seasoning on everything. Mm. Yes, Old Bay is also owned by McCormick. I don't like Old Bay. 
It's I fine. love Chalupa. Kimbo, are you trying to upset people right now? No. You just lost all your Maryland subscribers. All six of them, or all no anyone <laughs> in the Northeast, you just lost their love because you don't like Old Bay. I don't dislike it. I just don't like it as much. Well, it's as too late to cover for it now. <sighs> I hate everything. D says woohoo. See, she agrees. Woohoo! <laughs> no, I like um Cholula. Me too. That's really good. Really good. Because I don't. I like a hot sauce. Like I don't like a one, and I don't like like steak sauces. I think are really gross. I don't like steaks. I'm like, why? What does steak sauce have to do with hot sauce? Like Heinz fifty seven. It has like just this off taste, and like the red Frank's Red Hot has like that. It's not an off taste, but it's like a specific taste. Whereas like Cholula has like this warm, richer flavor. It's like a different acidic profile. Yeah, or whatever something. it is. I don't know what they use in it, but I like it a lot better. I feel like Frank's is really good for like chicken wings and buffalo chicken dip and like chicken sandwich things, though. Why are we talking about this? I don't know. You just started talking about it. That's true. I'm just going to flick some of this on. Freckles! Don't you wish you could make your own freckles like that? I mean, if I wanted freckles, heck yes. If I wasn't so lazy, I would do makeup every day and just like have a different look. I don't know if I would. But then I also remember I don't care. <laughs> exactly. So I'm like, nah. this isn't giving me as much control as I wanted. I was going to try and do like, you know, the dark freckles across kind of like the fur. Well, just take it, take it easy because they're going to be darker after they dry, right? After you like dab them. Usually watercolor dries lighter. But, you know, what else? I mean, it's fine. It's like really dark across. I might even give her some dark eye shadowy makeup stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and some other freckles just here and there. Why not? That was too much. Toothbrush in the water cup. Another paper towel. Just a half one. I'm going to lighten this all just a little. Just a little. And then what was I going to Oh, yeah, I was going to do like some kind of eye makeup y thing because like they have this cute. My face open. Thank you. Because it has like, you know, this dark strip like across and it goes under the ears. So I want to. Are you going to do white eyebrows because he has little white marks? I don't know, Rocky. I didn't think it does it. No, oh, because I already gave her dark eyebrows. Oh, there's like little white 250 tufts. 250 right, tufts. We'll see. Whatever you want. I'm going to add a little brown, a touch of black to dull it down and water it out and hope for the best. And I kind of want it to be like she did some fun, weird, crazy eye makeup. And it goes under the top of her ears. She didn't learn about blending. She hasn't watched those TikToks. <laughs> I watch people on TikTok doing these makeup tutorials and they just do it in like five seconds. I'm like, what well, is happening? They probably fast forward. It would take me an hour and a half and it would still look like poo. I'm sorry, when you can just dab your finger in something and then magically you have like this amazing glitter highlight on your face. I'm like, what? Who are you even? Wizards. Just make it a little lighter going across. Oh, it kind of curves around. I'm getting like raccoon vibes. It's because they have the little bandit mask. Yeah. All right, I'm going to do the brown nose. That was you in elementary school with your teachers. <laughs> no, I was just an amazing student. Okay. Jenna says, same thing with the hair tutorials. It's like magic. I know. How do they do it? How do they do it? Like, how many times have they practiced these things? I don't know. But I did try one of the, I did like a 3D braid on Rocky when I saw one on TikTok. And I was like, I can do that. And then I did. And it was like, I. Well, your hair was super, if your hair wasn't so nasty. <laughs> <laughs> God. No, it was, it was my first time. But like, it'd be easier if like your hair was wet. We don't need to hear about your first time, Kimmel. You were there. This is a family channel. That's true. I'm doing just a warmer color in the ears. Not that you can really tell, but just want to warm that up a little. Just warm it up. Just a scotch. And then the face is white, but oh well. I guess all the neck is too, but I can't control the splats. I'm not in control of what's happening. All right. Oh, I guess I can do a little bit on the lips. She has like just pink lips. Um, looking. I'm a mama. So this is probably why my, excuse you, you go over there now. This is probably why these get gunky is because I use a dirty brush. <laughs> and I touch the tip like this, which isn't great. Maybe that's just the only way you should use them then. 
because it can add bacteria from whatever's on my brush and the paper and whatever's in my water and blah, 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 so on and so forth. But that was plenty of time. just want to breathe on it, really. A <sighs> chill. <laughs> I do want to try and drag the color out just a little bit. You know, it's like, like, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? But it'll be a nice base color because I'm going to do colored pencils over the top. Yeah, just a touch of the red in the up there, just a touch. Okay. Jenna says, tonight Kimball is using Jane Davenport Incredible Inks and Watercolors, Tim Holtz Distress Mica Spray, and Stain, and Prismacolor Color Pencils. And the snack for tonight are chocolates from Italy. Let me demonstrate. Actually, they're from Home Goods that are from Italy, but yes, that is true. Home mm. Goods is our Italian escape now. Yeah. Okay. White. Gonna add in. Hi, little buddy. Hey, Kimmy. Okay. I need to sharpen this just a little bit. Just because the wood is on the edge and I don't want to like scratch the paper. The Laura says, hi everyone. It is winter here in Niagara. Hope you're having a warmer weather wherever you are. Um, well, welcome. It was like it felt like what, 11 degrees today or something? It was like 18 when I woke up. Nancy says they have a McCormick warehouse here in Reno. Really? There's a McCormick warehouse there? Rocky's got to look this up right now. I need to dry this because I, have I no just idea. scratched the page. I mean, it would make sense to have a West Coast distribution center. They've got McCormick's all over the world. Well, there's a McCormack plastic surgery. That is not it. What mm. else do we have? What do they do? Bad. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I don't see Sound it. Sound it out now. Maybe its address isn't listed. Maybe it's just a warehouse and they're like, don't come looking at us. Maybe it's a distribution center. I don't know. All right. That's probably no cool. idea. Let's try. Ooh, that's, that's warm. Toasty. Oh, that's better. Not scratching the page and we can actually add some details. So it was so cold here today. I had to, there was a good half of an inch of ice on my window. I had to scrape off and my hands were so cold because it's only like 27 degrees, but it feels like 11. I got in the car. I was like, Kimball, I can't even describe how cold I am right now. I was like, Oh, me too. Here, let me put the heat on you now. <laughs> it's not my car. There's some white here. Hmm. There's like white. Like that white there, I don't know. We'll just we'll add some little things here and there. And that's how it works, right? Yeah, it's just whatever you want. You just kind of look and just randomly place things. That's art. That's how I live my life. <laughs> we all heard it, Kendra. <laughs> we all heard it. I ain't ashamed of my body. Very natural. When that song came out, I was like, "Do what you want, what you want with the body." Da, 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 da. They weren't talking about that. Well, they should have been. All right, I think I'm just gonna go all browns, colored pencils in the eye. This is a paintbrush. That's not gonna help. I think the good thing about art is it can just really come in Actually, all forms. I'm gonna do some yellow in her eye first, and then we'll use the brown over it. Rocky probably wants to show something. I do. So. Not that it's appropriate, but this is, you know, art. And hey, he was still why hungry. Why are you showing this? Why not, Kimball? Don't you think that's a good adaptation? I don't know. I don't even know what it is. It's like, isn't it from like that caterpillar book that we read when we were in kindergarten? Remember yeah. he kept eating and eating and eating. He was still hungry. I mean, it just sounds like an autobiography for me. Gotcha. Um, what are your plans this week, by the way, Kimball? What are you doing? What are you going to do with your I'm life? I'm going to try and find a little more time for myself. <laughs> I Don't look at me like that. I'm going to continue my Jane Davenport prompts because those are fun. Like what? They're, they're mythology ones. I don't know what the next ones are. No, you said stop looking at me like that. Oh. And I think Persephone is the next one I need to do. We'll see. She's got that golden glow. It reminds me of when, like, way back when, or maybe they still people still do say when you like you pass away and they put like gold coins on your eyes. Mm. 
Janine says, Eric Carl is my favorite children's author and artist. I love all his books. He's the one that did The Hungry Caterpillar, right? I don't know. You're I the one so. that's all like, remember this book? And I was like, I, no. You don't remember it? I know. I mean, I've seen it. I don't remember reading it. All right. So Cutie Patootie has dark eyes. The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carl. This one. You don't remember this? <sighs> As I said, yes. Okay. <laughs> but I did not read it. But well, I it, know it. Let me tell you, just the Sparks Notes version of this book, Kimball, it was basically about a caterpillar. No way, did he? And eat? he was very hungry. Is that why there's like a chunky caterpillar in that one thing that he has like a cute voice and I don't know what his accent is, but it's adorable. Yes, but to unlock the full narrative, you're going to have to buy that at walmart.com. No. Forward slash history. Mm-mm. All right, we've got the shadow from her eyelids. We've got her pupil in. Hmm, we can do lashes in a little bit. Uh-oh, according to this very, very long email address, my Amazon account has been put on hold, and I just need to re-enter my password information to reactivate it. Should I do it, everyone? Yes, why are you even asking? From newsletter-82rqnnwcbpsy.com. Well, that sounds, like, legit. I'm going to do it right away. Are you sure it's not like a prince... From some like Middle Eastern country. <laughs> no, that was earlier this morning. Okay. We love them. I love the one that's like, this is Beyonce and I forgot my wallet. Can you like send me some money and I'll bring you like to my next concert? Wow. And I was all like, Is that real? Someone didn't someone really somebody, tried to do that? Somebody posted, yeah. They're like, what the hell is this? They're like, I'm sorry, girl. <laughs> I cannot help you out. Um, I didn't really bring any like golden colors, but I do want like Hmm, this will probably work. Well, if you're going to shut off, then you're going over there. Um, I always get very tempted when people write my phone and they're like, hey, how's David doing? And I'm like, I don't know who this is or who David is. I like, I want to just respond anyway. Like, I just want to be like, that's fine. How's, how's Adam? Adam's great. Good old David and Adam. Bonnie says, I'm back. Could I quickly say to both Kimmel and Rocky, thank you so much for this. It means everything. Well, you're welcome. I mean, it probably looks nothing like a ferret, but... It looks nothing like your ferret as a human being. It's the thought that counts. That's right. It's what inspired this whole thing. Oh, Noah, just reminding me, I should give the people from the Amazon my mother's maiden name as well. And my, my first yes. pet in elementary yes. school. Yes, all of this. By the way, if you're ever on Facebook and it's like a quiz, it's like, Start naming these things, and they include things that might be password clues. Probably don't do it. Yeah. Just going to throw that out there. Yeah, that's a bad idea. We're going to give her some lashes. It's the like, more you know. What street did you grow up on? How far away do you live from your hometown now? Or it's like your stripper name, and it's like all these things that you could use as like password clues. Yeah. Blues clues. My stripper name is Kimball. Kimball, what was the elementary, or I'm sorry, what was the, like, kids show you watched the most growing up? Like, I watched cartoons. Okay, like what? Uh, like, Gummy Bears. Gummy Bears! My Little Pony. Bounce here and there and everywhere. Uh, Wait, what else did you, you didn't watch, like, any kids shows, though? Like, what? Mr. Rogers. No. Molly and the Big Couch, whatever it You're was. You're making that crap up. I had. I am not making up Molly. You don't know Molly in the big something couch. Was she related to Gallagher and his giant couch? I mean, kind of. And the big comfy couch. Oh, okay. Well, that sounds more familiar. Oh, okay. Her eyebrows aren't even. We're gonna give her highlights in the eyes. Don't worry. That's gonna happen later, though. We all know what's gonna happen. You don't remember? You don't remember this, Kimball? <sighs> Maybe. I've seen pictures. And she does the clock thing with her legs. Yeah, see, on I, the you, ground. Oh, you made me watch an episode of that like a year or something ago. And I was like, this is dumb. Why would you watch this? Kimball, it's not dumb. Look at her. She is not dumb. She's also not insane. Oh, okay. <laughs> you can tell by that picture. What have you done with your life, Kay? Look what she did. She made friends and was on a big comfy couch. She's all like, I'm going to make freckles on TikTok. And now what everyone wants to know is where is Molly? You know what? She knew she could. Where is Molly? So she did. Um. Anyway, <laughs> so you didn't watch like Mr. Rogers or any of those shows? No. Um, that explains a lot, I guess. Okay. I watched Fraggle Rock sometimes. <laughs> Jenna's all, she was a clown. And then Cassie says, she's so cute, Kimball Hart. Thanks. 
Care Bears? Did you watch Care Bears? Yes. Denise asks. Care Bear Stare. Oh, and I watched like Thundercats and He-Man. Uh, I like those kind of cartoons. Bonnie wants to know, could I ask dot, dot, dot? She didn't really put dot, dot, dot. But she says, what your reaction was when I asked you to draw this? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Um, curiosity, because I didn't know really what ferrets looked like. I mean, I knew what they looked like, but I like never actually like stared and studied a ferret before. So I thought it'd be fun. And I knew they had long necks, so I thought that would be fun. And uh, I thought I would just... Yeah, I don't know. I was like, yeah, I can do this. I can do it. And I'm so I enough. did. I'm smart enough. And gosh darn it. Is it gosh darn it or god darn it? Dog, god, dog, darn it, dog, darn it. I'm pretty sure it's not dog that hot mess you just spilled out your Probably mouth. Probably not. People like me. I don't know. I was excited. It was something new, something I hadn't done before, but something that wasn't so far out of the realm of like my comfort zone. Lauren says, sorry, I'm late to the party, cat face. Hi, wave everyone. I know you ain't calling us the cat face. No, she just put a cat face emoji. Okay. <laughs> I was like, either way, it's actually it's fine because I can totally see it's a cat. Noah used to watch real Ghostbusters, Thundercats, G.I. Joe for afternoon power. Yeah, I watched Thundercats for the plot. I used to watch Garfield and Friends before school every morning, but I could only get to the part where they get to like the farm animal, like the second half, and then I'd have to go after like a minute of that. So um, I never knew what happened to the farm animals. I went to my preschool a half hour early so I could watch My Little Pony without missing anything because I couldn't run around the block and during a commercial break, like halfway through. What else exciting happened this week? Oh, I had to do a voiceover, like last minute video voiceover. And so I like rushed up to the room and was like, you did good. Kimball, be quiet. Well, I don't think you really did that because I'm and just naturally like, quiet. And center myself. I'm a very quiet person. I was, I was like writing my mom at the time, just talking to her. I was like, mom, I can't talk right now. I have to do a voiceover. She's like, what's a voiceover? I was like, I'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> and that's love. And then she's like, you're brilliant. Obviously. I want Thanks, mom. more of a brown color. That was a little too gray. Adrian says, Mighty Mouse Strawberry Shortcake Series. Ooh, I do like Strawberry Shortcake. She was fun. And Rainbow Bright. Mighty Mouse was cool. Danger Mouse was cool. I feel like I had a crush on Danger Mouse. Or I think it was my first crush I ever had. I think I was like three years old or four years old. And I was like, sure, Jan. I like Danger Mouse, like, but more than a friend. <laughs> um, Noah had a crush on Chitara, mainly because her name almost sounded like Cheetos. Oh, I love Chitara. I love Chitara and Cheetos. Do you think Chitara loves Cheetos? I don't think she ever had the pleasure. I guess not, because she's not real. She's not real, Noah. That's all, because she lived a long time ago in a fantasy land. And then Laura said, Lauren says, she ra princess of power. We love her. Her I'm name's She-Ra. She's a hero. Oh, my God. What is that from? What is the actual song? Captain Planet. Captain Watch Planet. that for the plot, too. Sure you did. <laughs> I, did like... a, I did a hot, saucy picture of Captain Planet once. I mean, it's not like It was definitely too saucy. modeled after me, for sure. Yes. I thought, this is Rocky if he were blue. <laughs> and had worked out for two hours a day for the past three years. No, well, maybe. Um... I don't know what to do for her hair. Should I just have it like slicked down? Or should I have it kind of coming that way? As I just like wave my hand all over the page. Hair, should I have it What if you did or... like a small short hair and then she's wearing like a fur thing around here so it keeps going down now? Oh yes, let's have the half human, half ferret person be wearing fur. Like, oh no, this but isn't it's a real faux fur. fur from oh. like Burlington Coat Factory, okay? It's not Burlington like... Coat Factory. Exactly. No. She don't buy Dolores that, right? watched Roy Rogers and Dale Evans. What is that? <laughs> and I'm not even sure. Was that on like same time Howdy Doody was on? Like I'm not sure. Like oh, I watched Gilligan's Island though. That was like fun. That, that was, like, wasn't cool. a kids show. That was adults stuck on an island, Kimball. But it was funny. You're gonna tell me like Green Acres was a kids show and Mash? I didn't watch. I mean, I saw a lot of Mash, but I didn't like. You know, I wasn't like, oh my god, Mash is on. Everyone, shh. Adrian says bun on the head, Kimball. Just a big head? <laughs> my hair is just a floof today. No, bun on the head for you were asking what kind of hair to do. But what kind of hair would a ferret have? Well, I was thinking like slicked back because they're so like sleek looking. I, like it should be a short hair thing, I think. Well, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Because it's not, you're not going to see it at the top because much of it's going to be cut off. Oh, okay. Well, whatever you want then. I think that's what you should do. Mm. 
Yeah, that motion, that like mm. backward C. Yes. Mm. I see you. <laughs> That's how Sue sees it. Bonnie right. says, I wasn't in a kid's TV series. More movies that I could rewatch. A couple of my favorite animated films, Alice in Wonderland, Beauty and the Beast, and Robin Hood. Robin Hood was oh, also like my first or like second crush. Robin Hood, little John, Robin Hood, Robin What's up with you like crushing on animal humans? And that was all I was watching when I was a kid. Well. And Freddy Krueger. Okay. So well, who was I going to have the crush on? Johnny Depp. Robert Heller. England, John Robin Hood. in a crop top. Thank you. I didn't watch number one. I watched like Dream Warriors, number three, Kimball. Nerd. <laughs> Where did it all begin, Rocky? I had zero monitoring into what I watched as a kid. And look how I turned out. I'm fine. I can Question mark. vouch for that. Dolores wrote something and then retracted her message. So I'm not sure what it was, but it was probably really spicy and juicy. She's like, yeah, couple of homos. <laughs> delete, delete, delete. <laughs> She's like, wait, we're not that close. We can't be that funny. We can't we can't say that just yet. I guess. You can. I ain't mad at it. Words don't really hurt me. Don't test me on that. <laughs> if you're enjoying our highly intelligent banter, don't forget to click that thumbs up and subscribe for more quality content. Wow, we're really pushing for the likes and subscribes on this one. I feel like I should have like a little thing on a popsicle stick that oh, pops in, like said. a little graphic that's like, don't forget to like and subscribe. You stay over there now. I'm going to make that and print it out. Tell me, demonstrate it at parties. Remember when you worked for that one company and you just made a face on a broomstick and you're like, mm, everyone go crazy. And then people like started cheering. It was like a theme park ride. Yes. I used to work at Six Flags for this like <laughs> virtual reality air quotes again, virtual reality ride. And basically I'd be on a green screen in a back room and there'd be 20 people up on stage. I'll pay $5 a pop to sit in these chairs and I'm just waiting for somebody them. to be like, I remember that. I remember you. Yeah. So <laughs> basically this was in Santa Clarita, California. And we basically had to convince people that like the more they jumped around and screamed and were crazy, the more points they got. And so we'd monitor people and like I would get points. He would do it as best he could, but he would just tap the, the keyboard, which was like. I mean, I always was... knew who the winner was because you could just tell who was acting the most. I just made sure they won every time. But yeah. anyway. I, there was a green screen. So we were supposed to like appear as ourselves as this character in the game with these people. And I just got so like tired of doing it. I just basically took a broom that we used to clean the stage and I drew like a smiley face on it. And I just like held that up and I'd sit off to the side and use that. And the, the funny thing was <laughs> is when I started doing that, people got like twice as crazy. And so more it people would ridiculous. come and sign up. And then at one point I took like a, pig like a little stuffed pig and attach it to a wire coat hanger so it was just floating on, <laughs> on screen and the thing that was really funny is that the other actors that worked there were trying so hard to like because they were like as their characters trying to get the audience involved and they just weren't and they would get so angry there was so much resentment from this one guy I worked oh, with. but then eventually like after a good half a year he started doing it too because he was just tired right like rocky was putting in like five percent effort and getting like a hundred percent hey you know what work smarter not harder okay that's all i'm saying brooms and pigs that's all you gotta do well that could be misleading missy lulu says my favorite peeps i'm late how's everyone well we'd be fine if you click that thumbs oh up my God. button missy <laughs> click the thumbs up it's all good just kidding you don't have to good. kind of but we'll remember um all right hair's done i kind of want to like i don't know should i darken <laughs> whatever um Oh, I lights. wait, wait, time out. Though. Trisha has a great idea. She says, perhaps you could ring a little bell when someone likes and subscribes. Do we have a bell? Is there a bell? We have that Apple bell. Yeah, but I don't want to even think about that bell because the memory behind it is just like, I'm still traumatized from it. Jenna knows what I'm talking about. I replaced my iPhone. Well, I, I just replaced the picture. I have a clear case and I constantly swap out the photo inside. Now I have this one. I printed out some other ones too. These what? are feature cases. What if I took a Ooh. photo of you every time someone liked and subscribed one of your videos, just in whatever position you were in, and had a whole like album of like every time Kimball was liked? <laughs> no, we don't need to do that. Um, I was thinking. Adrian oh, says Tom Brady is coming back to football. Too bad, Giselle. Mm. What's happening? What Tom Brady is he married to Giselle, the model? I don't. Bunch of didn't he just name? retire? I don't know. Oh, because I watch the ball like Tom Brady. Tom Campbell. Let's go. Oh, wow. All you know about Tom Brady is his Hertz commercial. Yeah. And that's enough to make me not like him. He threw a football. Okay. That's what he did. 
I mean, I look like him. I meant, like, I don't like football. Don't. I'm missing something. I have to read the comment. Everyone just be quiet for a second. Rocky's concentrating. I can open Dolores this. says, I was a West... It was a Western, but I did watch Big Comfy Couch with my grandchildren, so she knows what, what's up. Mm. Uh... I don't know what I missed. I'm very confused, but I'm just going to let it go. I'm just going to let it go. Um, yes, she confirms that Tom Brady is married to Giselle. Now, see, I like her. So he must be a good guy. Um, Adrian says she wanted him to retire. Yes, I do not blame her. Right. If for nothing else is to have less concussions going forward. Mm-hmm. We saw a football player at the grocery store that's on the local team Huge. here. And Huge. And I was like, it's a good, it's like, it's always good to admire someone's physique and be like, wow, that's a lot of work. And like, they should be very proud of themselves. Especially when you stand next to them and you feel like tiny and petite. Thank you, mister. <laughs> but like, at the same time, I was like, oh my word. Like that is that person's life. Like that, that which is fine. I'm not saying it's bad. It's just like, that's, it's so, it's so interesting how different people's lives are like how everyone lives this different version of reality for like, themselves like that is some dedication like i am sorry but the thing is is like i was telling rocky i was like i would love to be able to work out and get a great like physique but like i don't want to do it for the rest of my life so you get this <laughs> jenna says we have a few parrots we had a few ferrets over the year but the two i had in high school actually found their way into my box spring and hit a ton of socks in there <laughs> They were just trying to make your mattress softer, Jenna. Oh. They wanted you to have a good night's sleep. I'm trying to find... That's like... Whoa, that just... She's got a mustache now. That's not what I wanted to do. I mean, it just I was too lazy to grab a peachy color. I feel like Sealy Posturepedic should have like a new brand of mattresses called the Ferret, where it's just like stuff with socks. Maybe Jenna socks. Hopefully not in ferrets. Um... Well, okay, I ruined that. Way to go, Kimball. <sighs> Thanks a lot, Marie Calendars. <laughs> well, whatever. She got a little stash on that side. If you don't know the Marie Calendars reference, basically this last year, some woman like baked a Marie Calendars thing and left it in the oven for way too long and it burned. And then she posted it and put, Thanks, Marie Calendars. <laughs> and then everyone started posting like memes about it. Like blaming all their oh, problems. Oh my gosh. So like any problem in the world is just like, Thanks, Marie Calendars. That's hilarious. I, I am still using it to this day. I obviously am too. Trisha says, Kimball. Yeah, bro. You have done some beautiful drawings this week. Would you oh, perhaps show you. us how to do the luscious hair that you, your myths. Mythology ones? Yeah. Do the luscious hair that your myths. Yes. From my mythology drawings. Do I have one? I don't know if I have one of those. Is it from the, the pencil mm. drawings you're doing? Yeah, like... Uh... So Kimball, if you guys don't know, Kimball posts a lot like in the Jane, Jane Davenport like Facebook group. So he uses the Happy Time pencil for a lot of the stuff he's been using lately. Yeah. Um, I mean, I could. I did do a drawing. Like, I did do a drawing live. Where did I put that? Like, I did a full. Where did it go? Not that. But one. did you fully describe it? Well, I did it as a whole live. It was like the. There's nothing you. happening on the screen right now, and everyone's There's bored. an elbow. There's Everyone's an, bored. You got this elbow. Look, I'm trying to... Where is it? Who was it? I don't know. Great. <sighs> I have too many sketchbooks She's out. like, have you seen my shoe? Don't look so proud of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I was more so waiting to gauge your reaction. She done. Okay, and we're on to the journal flip. We're gonna call her you, Eurus, Eris, Eris. Bonnie, how you say her name? Spell it out. Nancy Sound says it out. love her lips. Me too. She's like that pop of color. I'm gonna need to put these away, and uh, uh, then right, gonna... is that it? Are you done with that? Yeah, we're gonna journal flip it. Okay, perfect. One second. But I need to get all these put away because hurry! I'm, Everyone's bored. I'm a responsible artist. I put my stuff away when I'm done, and I all have a little home that they Mo. go to. <laughs> I'm their little home now. I'm the Mary. 
you're just a pasty hag on a deathbed. Romy and Michelle, have you seen it? Do you like it? If I already know the answer. I don't know. If anyone says no, like, you can unsubscribe me now. I feel like it's just a I'm given just if they're following this page that they either do like it or would, or if they hate it, we don't mind and accept them anyway. Journal, flip, coffee, sip. Wow. I'm just going to back that out just slightly. There you can just squeeze it out. Look, I can see your tummy. What's this leg down here, Kimball? What is that? I don't. What is that? I know, it's probably the stand that the camera's on. Well, what is it? That over there? That's the floor. Yes, I know. Oh, I'm all trying to figure. I'm like, what is it? My legs are here. Okay, that's important. Everybody remember Daphne? Daphne. She was the first uh, thing that we did live together. Those were the days, Daphne. And then this was a color blob that I went back and I just drew, I did inks over it. Oh, and question or answer to the question about the hair. Maybe next week I can just do a pencil drawing. We'll just do that again. Mm. You know, maybe I'll do one of the prompts. I'll see what it is. We'll figure it out together. Well, I'll figure it out myself and then, you know, you'll just go along with it. It'll be fun. Girl, ballpoint pens, Sharpies. Lord knows what else on there. More paint blobs that I turned into two girls in Plobs. hooded cloaks. They remind me of Jeanette and um, what are the oh, yeah, they do look chipettes like... or whatever. Yeah, and you what can see these? all the sparklies. Jeanette, oh my God. I know, right? Wow, it's been too, we really need to watch the chipmunk adventure. Jeanette, Brittany, and Eleanor. Eleanor. I wish she's like a third of the binoculars in the movie. She's like, in a chubby little butterball tied to a steak. <laughs> Theodore. Oh, there we've got, da da that's not Daphne, Velma. Velma. We've got the shiny the earrings. Luminous Velma. It's lots of cool. lots of shine happening on that one. I mean, lots of shine. When you add gold and highlights of yellow, how and how could you go wrong? Blats of metallics everywhere. Wasn't that alive as well? Yeah, yeah. Most of these are. Oh, oh but geez, oh. That was a fun one. I like doing the combined faces. More sparkly. I was just going to town with like these sparkly mermaid markers. I don't know if you can see all the glitter, you? but. Because you want your hair to look like that. Obviously. And a Sharpie. I think this was like some weird ink background and I painted. I'm getting like 80s happened. vibes. Yeah, well, you should. There's like neons and brights. And this, I used to have pants that had this pattern on it with like neon oranges and stuff. Oh, there's another combined face with some teeth. I feel like the eye in the center is legit staring at me. Like it's, it is. It's like I see it. Like yourself. it's partially real. Well, it's not. Oh, I think that is so cute. I love this picture of Tina. Oh, Bonnie is trying to explain how to pronounce. So it's um, uterus, U uterus, uterus. See, now I'm just, it just, everyone said it looked like a uterus when I started. So now that's like, oh, wow. Well, well, I think that matches then. Well, yeah. um, I like that. She says, watch Sherlock. It's the Holmes's sister. Ah, wait. I thought her sister was Enola. That's from the Enola Holmes series, You're the, but the Sherlock series. Oh, you know what? Too Wasn't much... that with ben Benjamin Cumberbatch? There's Cumberbatch too much going on. Cumberbundatch. She um, was my. I just traded her. She was my um, my phone background, my phone case Not for anymore. like ever. Oh, there she is. Urus, but the E is silent. I think. Urus. 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 Okay, you know what? We're just gonna call it Urus. Urus. This is from He Man. The sorceress of Castle Grey School. That's no Shitara. Chitara? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys. Self portraits are fun. I should do another one. This was easy. Just pink square and blue and yellow. Why not do another one? Oh my god, it's that uh, is how you felt about it. It's Daria and Jane. That's funny. Oh. Uh -huh. I like the blue lines. I like their hair. hair. The colors yellow and teal. Am I right, girls? You're right. Jam. The Sherlock series with C, she says with ben Benjamin or Benedict Cumberbatch. Benedict Cumberbatch. That's what I said earlier. Yeah. Anyway, moving on. Sound it out now, Benjamin. Jam! <laughs> oh, that's fun. Oh, that's the uh, Flame Princess from Adventure Time. Inspired by. I like her jewel. I love her. And then there's Princess Bubblegum from Adventure Time. Yum, yum. If you're just joining, Kimball has already finished the art for tonight. Kimball, just show it real quick. Just like pop it in. So Kimball was drawing a ferret woman. There she is. Urus. And now he's flipping through 
we only had two left. We wouldn't, how many did we have to start? Like 18 journals we flipped like through that, yeah. and now we're down to just one. So at the end of his lives, we basically flip through and do a journal flip. So there's only one left for next week. And then after that, I have like a file folder of loose artwork. Oh, so it's the fun isn't over guys. That's what he's trying to say right now. Mm. It's been an hour. Shut up you hole. All right. So this is Layer Cakes. This is when I very first got the Jane Davenport Layer Cakes, like the very first set that she had. And I was like, I'm gonna do a painting. And then I did a painting and I loved it. Yeah, very cool. But I get like scared because like, they're kind of like gouache. And, you like, said they... like three times in one sentence. Like whatever. Okay, moving on. <laughs> um, Because like, they lift. <laughs> Shut up. Don't you talk to me, Rainbow Bright. <laughs> is she like Layer Cakes? She is like Layer Cakes. But not really, because she is layer cakes. Mm. That's why it reminds me of cake. Ooh, it's Bright Virawit. I don't know how to say his last name. It's probably not even close. But his name, his English name is Bright. He is a, a Thai actor. I enjoy him. Crow-inspired girl. I don't know what watercolors those are. Are those jeans? Maybe. Some look like they are, some look like they aren't. Don't know. They don't look as vibrant. Archer! With layer cakes. I was on a layer cake kick. That's what I don't like about layer cake and gouache though, is that they dry kind of chalky and they like cross transfer. And I don't love that. That's also mm -hmm. why a lot of people are like, why don't you draw on both sides of your pages? Because I don't like it when they gunk up True. on each other. Lauren says Rainbow Bright, my favorite. Right? She's lovely. Right, right, Rainbow Bright. Lauren's this favorite. was watercolors. I'm all shish. <laughs> this was watercolors that I went over with the... Uh, Layer cakes. I did a lot of layer caking. Right. Well, yeah. New art supply. Hello. Right. Strawberry shot cake. Oh my gosh. The neon. It was like just a neon highlighter they had. It's totally fading. Neons aren't meant to last. Was it a highlighter? Yeah. It was just some highlighter. that I think I got it from Flying Tiger. Wow. Interesting. And she was drawn with a ballpoint pen. She looks a little cracked. That's out. like when people have that emoji where the head's exploding. Oh uh, yeah. Well, it's just trees, but you know, whatever. And I remember, like, I was going to use the fine tech, and everyone was like, use it. And I was like, oh, fine tech. And I just had <laughs> line across it. Uh, you know. That's funny. In true Kimball fashion. Okay, there is definitely a face on this side, like, looking that way. Yeah, with, creepy. like, a mouth and nose and an eye and, like, yeah, a little from, hair like, thing. those, like, scary stories to tell in the dark. He's like, hey, I guess. I don't know. This is, um. He wasn't blessed with the beauty genes. That's just a lot of shy for My Little Pony. She was. And Rocky's hands. all hands. Like, yeah, Rocky's all draw hands like this or whatever. Do you not remember that? I remember. Yes, that, you were yeah. very happy about me I was asking like, wow, you to do that. You make it so easy. Thank you. Hands. I mean, you really broke it down into shapes. Mm. And then that's Lisa Kudrow in a bikini, apparently. <laughs> okay. Well, whatever. Uh, also, Jem. Synergy. She's all. <laughs> <laughs> She's very cool. Yeah. No. Thank you. Good. Good cover. <laughs> He's not happy about it. <laughs> This was during, um, we'll say, election Stuff. season. Mm -hmm. Kimball mm -hmm. was struggling politically. Mm. Oh, I wasn't struggling. <laughs> I was not. <laughs> I'm sorry. The rest of America was struggling. Layer cakes moving on. from the We don't live in the past, Rocky. That's right. We live in this glorious future Ooh. we're in right now. And these are ladybug daughters. Very cute. Uh, watercolors. Chonky Sharpies. Ballpoint pens. She's looking at you like... You, you couldn't give me a background. This is all I got. Okay. We turn the page. Uh, we ignore her plight. I'm not sure what these are. I feel like... Bonnie they... says, who loves tea? Bonus points if it's Earl Grey. I am down with Earl Grey. All I'm saying is one of my favorite pictures is of this chick drinking tea. And it said, you better fix all my problems, you nasty bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a tea drinker, but I don't dislike tea. I love it. Matcha is my favorite, though. Yum, yum, yum. It's not even like. <laughs> I mean, put some cream and sugar in anything. I'll have it. I can't remember what I did. Lauren this way, says I like she it. might have missed the conversation at the beginning, but did you watch Turning Red? Yes, we did. We loved yes, it. Yes. Oh great. my god, it was so cute. I just wanted to go to a concert. <laughs> Noah says Gem is no. outrageous. Truly outrageous. Truly, truly. This is Pearl from Steven, Steven Universe. Universe. Also an amazing cartoon. Oh look, Steven Universe. This is Garnet. We love her. I also have like a big drawing of her over there. Oh my god, Nancy and Bonnie, you guys come hang out with Captain Picard and drink your Earl Grey. I just like the gold flex on there. Oh, and this is a uh, lapis 
Lasley. I don't know, people say it differently, whatever, which is my stone. And that's why I have Kimball. this huge one right here. Speaking of how to pronounce things, what did we learn about German shoemakers? We've been pronouncing the names wrong our entire lives. Adidas, not Adidas. <laughs> and then, well, Puma, Puma. I don't know if that's pronounced right, but what else? Oh, there was something else. There was a third thing. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. We didn't write know. it down, so we can't talk about it very well. Yeah. Pocahontas might know, though. She's so beautiful. She's beautiful. This is when I was doing, like, cartoons as lives, and I was, like, printing off just the cartoon pictures. She looks like the actual age that Pocahontas was during that time, because wasn't yeah. she, like, 14 or 15? Mm, yeah, she was, like, younger. And she's obviously painting with all the colors of the wind. She's like, I like my teal necklace. Mm, that's, um... Jeff Sater! Yeah. If you don't know, you don't know. <laughs> if you know, you know. Pink. I love this hairstyle. I do this hair like kind of often, not too often. Wasn't Maybe. there a movie called Run Lola Run? Yeah. And she had hair like that? Yes. Okay. Maybe a little bit longer. This was from... This is when you do ecstasy. This Okay, this is the face you make. Not that I would know from personal experience. <laughs> this is from Lifebook. <laughs> well, there you go. All the same. <laughs> uh, with Tamara Her Laporte. hair is so cool. Yeah, good save, Rocky. Good no, save. I mean, the whole piece is really cool. You must she's... have been on crack when you did that. It's beautiful. <laughs> oh, I love what you did. I can tell you really think Not you, you no, the character. No, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Crying stars. Jenna wants tea now. Well, drink don't, drink, tr don't drink tea unless you want to go pee, okay? That's the rule. So, gotta wait till after the live. I drink coffee to go pee. Anyway. Yes, the color palette was uh, Tamara Laporte's. Bonnie wants to know if you have the clownfish sketch in this one, or is that another book? I think it's a different book. That is a different It was one we went through last week. Last week. Right? Clownfish? Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Too bad. Missed out, Bonnie. It's all over. Dang it's it. over now. But if you just watch last week's oh, video, you will see it. This was with like, oh my gosh, I think it's Oh one. my gosh, Kim was so excited. teeny tiny little watercolor palette. <gasps> Look at that. Look at that. Little teeny tiny. That's a great palette hey, though. Hey, hey. You get back in there. That's a great color palette. I know. Let's build a website. All right. Um, you can, it, has, it comes with the watch strap, so you can wear it on your hand like this if you want to do plein oh air. Oh, my gosh. And you can, like, be out there all, like, painting. Anyway, Jane Davenport, it's lovely. Archer. Hmm, that's cute. Cute little Archer. Uh, I don't know. I drew this with... Um, I put some cocoa ink into... A fountain pen. Is Coco Ink Incredible Ink? Yeah, it's this right here. Hot Coco Ink. And I put it in one of... Oh my god, where are my cute little pens? Oh, they're over here somewhere. Ugh. So many things in my art room, y'all. I need to, like, downsize. Everyone barely cares. Yeah, that's true. I'm turning the page. She's somebody, but I don't remember who. Or else someone was like, make her a cat girl. I don't know, but she's cute. She's cute. She's cute. She's cute. I don't know she is. She's cute. Kimball, there are 20 people watching and nine thumbs ups. And they're all like, why are you still in this book? <laughs> like, well, if you guys do enjoy Kimball's lives, make sure to give him a nice thumbs up and subscribe for quality content. Thanks. <laughs> oh, okay. I feel like I should just have like a button that like just makes that. Jenna says, should I make honeycomb chai, pumpkin creme brulee, or cardamom French toast tea? Like all of them in one. Or thing. is she talking about like, yeah, probably. That goes over there now. Thanks. I think we're done. No, we're not, Kimball. There's still so well, much more. We, Don't tune out yet. Well, I got a thing to show. I mean, we're done with the art portion of today's corner of off. Kimball. One second. I got a drink. Look, there's a pumpkin. Oh, you can't see it. But there's a pumpkin in the bottom of my cup. Gosh, get off the stand. Kimball, if you could just push that stand out of the way, that'd be great. Thanks. Now I gotta change all the settings so it looks pretty again. Um, I'm always pretty, thank you. All right, and Pumpkin here we are. Light cup. up, Pumpkin. and okay, we're back. Pumpkin in the cup. All, all right. right, let me. Well, I was trying to zoom in, Kimball. Oh, oh no. my god, it's fall. Is it? Whoopsies! It's already March and it's snowing. It's like the perfect size cup for me. And then we also learned that Lauren has dictated what Jen is going to be drinking tonight, so that's good. Well, that's good. Um, yes. So first off, thank you all for joining. Appreciate it. Love you. Uh, <laughs> Kimball can hear the zoom every time. Cause it sounds like this. And then we went and we got this done, which I think it turned out quite nice. So this is the piece we got from the gentleman in Paris. And then we got like this really cool. Let me actually get in closer so you can see. So it's a very cool 
old world frame. And then we had this like gold, what did they call these fillets or something? Yeah. I don't remember what they're called, but the guy helped us. They, and Michael's, they actually had a program not sponsored where well, he could take a picture of this and show us what different frame combinations would look like. So that actually really helped. Yeah. Once he was like, Oh, you can combine frames by the way. So tilt we, it back this way slightly. There you go. So we like, okay. So obviously there's a shortage of things happening. So all the True. frames that we really wanted were gone and we're like, you know, we don't know when they're going to get back in stock. Back to Baxter Stockman turtles. Um, Whatever, so I just wanted to get it done. And so we combined some stuff, made it happen. It was fun. Also, this book, I drew my character Cerberus after like reading through this book. It's just like how to draw adorable animals. So cute. So cute. Money well spent. <sighs> By Phoebe M. I don't know. Anyway, very adorable. If you want to learn how to draw really cute animals, super simple. And then Rocky was like, show the picture. Bonnie story. says you made her night. Thank you. Bye. Oh, you're welcome. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> have a good night. So here's last week. You might have seen Kimball's amazing. No, don't build it up. Landscape drawing. Anyway. No, it was colored blobs. It's nothing amazing. I'm still probably going to Can you actually show us though? Is that? I don't know. I'm looking at it again. Okay, let me see. Hold still. So I added some pen detail. So it looks like. Let me get in real close. So you can see the texture. See the paper? I mean, it looks cool. Right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. Anyway, it helped define it a little bit more, but yeah, I still hate it. So I think I'm going to, and I'm not one of those people that's going to like throw things away. I need to look at it and be like, yes, I do hate that, but for these reasons, and let's not make that crap happen again. I think my biggest problem was trying to do a foggy, very white image on dark yellow paper. Didn't think that through, did I? And so, it's not watercolor paper. It absorbed way too much. Missy says, now looks better. <laughs> that's true, girl. <laughs> um, so I'm going to try, I might try it again, just doing it on a uh, white paper and see if I can pull it off a little bit better. But you Use like actual watercolor paper. It'll be better. Mix me your paper. Why don't you just tell me how to live my life? See, that's too close. That's too close. When I look over there and my face is filling the screen. <gasps> Let's look at my eye. Wait, wait, sit there for a second. We're going to do that filter where you like, right, one second. Ready? Here we go. There you go. Like and subscribe for quality content such as this. What are you doing? Oh, the background jupe thing? Is yeah. that we oh. anyway? Um <laughs> so Kimball. Yeah, I'm a little what else is happening? Well, um, I'm going to finish these, not all these chocolates, just like one more. One of these ones, I guess. Oh yeah, did anybody ever say? I don't know what this flavor is. Um this right here, Gian Duja. You could just focus on that right there. I don't know what that is. I don't know. That's a good question. Because it's the same in Italian as well. Because on the back, it has all the Italian flavors, and then it has it in English, and it's spelled the same. And I don't know what that is. I ain't mad at it. But yes, I think we are done. I think we're going to go downstairs. Oh, Kimball's had it. We're done. That is it. We're going to go downstairs and play some games. What are we going to play? Forbidden West. How are we going to play it? PlayStation. Alone. <laughs> okay. Because I'll probably play I'm all home goods. <laughs> well, Kibble, open the piece. You have to do the sign-off music. Amateur hour over here. God, I like. Actually, you hold it open and aim it towards me and I'll get it. That's what she said. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Sign-off music. Goodbye. I only had time to put on pink lips. The rest is all natural. You're welcome. <laughs>